Hey there! It's time for the Bug Bites Hands-On section, where you budding scientists lead the activity. Put on your thinking caps, because things are about to get scientific! So we are going to see a series of videos today that I'll show you right now. And while we're watching those videos, I want you to think about what does it mean to be a good bug parent. I want you guys to check out these videos. Anyone know what that bug is right there? Earwig! Yep, that's an earwig right there. See her taking care of her babies right there? She's a very good mom to her babies. Do you think we have what it takes to be good bug parents? Yes! yes. So what we are going to do, we're going to take eggs, real eggs, and we're going to try to wrap them up with the soft stuff here, kind of like the spider did, and then see if we can drop them from Egg Drop Mountain and see if they survive. What do you think of that? Yeah, that's great. Oh, you want to give that a try? Good idea. I'm going to give everyone an egg. Hold your egg, OK? You guys ready? Yes. All right, let's do it. So guys, we have a number of neat, soft things on the table to help protect our eggs. Daniel, what are you making over here? I'm going to wrap this up like into a ball so it won't break. That sounds great. I'm putting this fluffy stuff over it to make it look pretty. Guys, these are looking really good. All right, guys, let's get in the line here now so that we can drop our eggs off of Egg Drop, egg mountain. drop mountain. Does everyone think their egg is going to survive? Sienna, do you want to give this a shot first? That's a really nice one, huh? Now we've got one left. I made the egg sack to be like the wolf spider. There are four eggs in here. What do you think is going to happen? Guys, look at this. Looks like I still have some bug parenting classes that I need to take, right? <laughs> but maybe I can take them from you because you guys did such a good job. Here. Oh, thank you very much. Thank you so much for learning how to be a great bug parent with me today. And to all you folks at home, thank you so much for watching. Stay with us because we have new experiments coming all the time and you have got to check them out. Hey, Adam, how many brothers and sisters does Gilbert have? I don't know, but one cockroach living in my house is plenty. Hey, we better go check on it. Come on. <laughs> <laughs>